G'day, my name's Tom and this is Australian Stereotypes, Expectation versus Reality. So buckle your seatbelts ladies and gentlemen, because you're about to find out what we actually do versus what you think we do. Let's get into it. First of all, who said we all live near the beach? Ah, uh, that'd be me. We don't though. Yeah we do. No, we don't. Yes, we do. Anyway, anyway the two of us are going to drive to the beach now, so... <laughs> I don't know. Can I have some? Alright. <coughs> How about some music or something? Whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa, living on a prayer. Take my. Yeah, stop. Don't don't do that. Ben in it. Ben in it. Bin in it, bin, 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 bin it. Boom, boom. Fuck yeah. 72 hours late. Are we there yet? No. We're not there yet. Okay. There's still seven hours to okay. go. Asking. We're making a Vegemite sandwich. If you're not using the whole jar, you're the joke. Some of you might be saying, mate, this is a small jar. What are you doing? I disagree. To that I say, this is my Sunday jar. I'll eat this thing in one day. <coughs> now to make a Vegemite sandwich, two simple steps. Step one, Vegemite. And step two, and that's how a real Aussie does it. Let's be honest, that's not how you actually make a Vegemite sandwich. This is the legitimate way that actual humans We'll make a Vegemite sandwich opposed to the whole stereotype of Australians being um, that guy. So, start off. Butter your bread. Alright, now a thin layer of Vegemite. We're not messing around with a whole jar. Because one, it's a waste of money. And two, no one would want to eat that. And as the French would say, voila. There you go. Vegemite sandwich. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> So it's said in Australia that every animal, that every animal is trying to kill you. I'm here today with the common house cat, and it, you can see, barely escaped with my life at that one. Bloody hell. Jesus Christ. When in reality, they're just big softies. Oh, Jesus Christ. Shh, 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 shh. Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. That one might be true. Fucking hell, she tried to kill me. In Australia, everything's cooked on the barbecue. Think you can bite me? Huh? Think you can make a fool out of me? Huh? Huh? Damn it. Your bloody dinner's gone. When in reality, well, we actually do cook everything on the barbecue. I think this one's ready. It's ready. You guys want to see? All right. Cuisine. Mm. And that's what I like to call medium rare. So here's how you actually make a Milo the Australian way. You've got your tin of Milo, your cup, and your milk. All right, here we go. Let's make this Milo. Start off with your Milo. <coughs> and the only other step is to pour some milk, really. <laughs> a bit much. There you go. There you have it. Perfect cup of Milo. It's really good. It's a really good guy. This is the best mile I've ever had. Look, in reality, that's not actually how you're going to make a Milo. 
I know that there's going to be some people in the comment section that are all like, that's not actually how you make a Milo. If you're not using a whole tin, you're not making a real Milo. Um, the only people who are saying that are the ones who've never actually bought their own Milo. Because that shit's pricey as hell. Um, I think this tin was like $5 or something. So yeah, this is how you actually make a Milo. Boom. One spoon. Two spoons. Three spoonfuls of Milo. And that's literally it. <laughs> there you go, here's your Milo. All right, now this one you know is definitely true. At this point, I've kind of lost the whole concept of which character's which, but that doesn't matter. This stereotype is so true. Every Australian is tan. <clears throat> All right, I'll put this one to bed. This one's true. Every Australian has a wicked tan. All right, you guys ready? One second. Anyway guys, that was the video. If you did like it, leave a like, subscribe, tell your grandma to watch it, all that kind of stuff. I appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Give me all of your money, now.